Are you a smart cookie? The Tale of Two Pebbles. One day, a pretty little girl went on a quest to explore her surroundings. La 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 la. Hello, my pretty. What are you doing in my kingdom? I'm lost. Can you help me find my way back? There is no way out of my kingdom alive. Is there anything I can do? Okay, pretty lady. Today is your lucky day. I will propose a deal. I will put a black pebble and a white pebble into the empty bag. All you have to do is pick one pebble from the bag. If you pick the white pebble, I will let you go. If you pick the black pebble, you will get eaten alive. And if you refuse to pick a pebble, you will also get eaten alive. <laughs> The observant girl watches the witch put two black pebbles in the bag. Two black pebbles. Oh no! What does that mean? And black pebbles meant that the girl will get eaten alive. Now the girl has a few choices to make. One, she can refuse to take a pebble, which means she'll get eaten alive. Two, she can pick a pebble, and we know that it will be black, and she's doomed to get eaten alive. And choice number three. She can show that the bag really contains two black pebbles in the bag, and expose the witch as a cheat. This might make the witch mad, and she will get angry. Which means that she might also get eaten alive. What will the little girl do? What would you do if you were the little girl? The little girl's plan. The girl picks a pebble from the bag and throws it to the ground. Oh, how clumsy of me! Says the little girl. But never mind. If you look in the bag for the one that is left, you'll be able to tell which pebble I picked. Since the remaining pebble in the bag is black, we must assume that she picked a white pebble. The witch did not want to admit her dishonesty and was quite impressed by the girl's clever thinking and actions. The girl changed what seemed to be an impossible situation into her advantage. The witch decides to let her go free. What did we learn from the story today? We learned that the little girl looked beyond the obvious to find a solution in a way that would have not come to our minds with logical thinking. We have to get creative and look outside of the box for solutions. Remember, there is no limit to our imagination and creativity. Don't forget to hit the like button if you enjoyed our lesson today, and subscribe to our channel for more fun and creative stories to make you a smart cookie.